everybody. Um, this week we've been talking a lot about fascia, what it is, uh, how does it present and how do we treat it. Um, and today I just thought that I would go through um, a technique that I use all the time uh, to uh, not only relax the dog, but also um, treat fascial restrictions. Um, it's very easy. I'm sure most of you um, have seen it before. Um, all you do is you use your index finger and your thumb and it's a technique called skin rolling. Uh, so let's get into it. Paige loves skin rolling. Anything that decompresses her, she's right on board with all of it. Uh, so I'll show you very quickly um, how to do that for a bit of a refresher on treating fascia. So how I start is I like to assess uh, the fascial glide to begin with with my hands. So all I do is place my hands on the dog and I just have a feel of the glide of the tissues. They should move around freely. There shouldn't be any adhesions or any restrictions through there. Um, and then I begin. So I start with my thumbs and my index finger. I just pick up a bit of a skin roll and I'm just very lightly lifting it off the layers underneath. And I'm just slowly winding that up. Now, I've just got to a bit of a sticky spot here with Paige and she's just sort of letting me know about it. So you can slow down and take it a little bit more quietly. Um, but skin rolling is a really good way to not only treat fascial restrictions, but also to assess um, as you go as well. 